Tip number 20, so this should be the last one. Generative design provides a setup that you can bring into simulation to adjust. So you can imagine we generated this part, we've started making adjustments to those sketches, looking at the machining, radius analysis. How do we know that that part is still compliant to all of the loading conditions that we set up at the beginning? So if we go back to Fusion 360, and we have our outcome CAD geometry. All that we have to do is go to the workspace drop down at the top left and go over to simulation. When we do that, it says it looks like the design was created with generative design. Do you want to use that setup information within a simulation solve? And when I press yes, what it will do here in just a minute is it will bring in the study material. So in this case, 6061 all of the load cases that we set up within generative so we don't have to do it again and then all we have to do from here is maybe adjust our mesh and we can run this simulation solve either locally or on the cloud so if i run that locally this should take just about 30 seconds and we can then again validate that any change that we made to that geometry that we've adjusted after generative design has it compliant still So now you can see I have my factor of safety calculated and I have all of the load cases that I can now look at. And that took just about a minute.